Brandon sh- Brandon's show with his wife. <laughs> a girlfriend is a wife, dude. Oh, that's true. Are we? Uh, are yeah. we go? Is the she's show going? The, yeah, we already started. She's I mean, one of the because stream of consciousness writer. Like I wanted to get Tumblr girls. Yo, I wanted. You get, wanted to get secretly. No, no, I wanted to get a second of silence, but you guys wouldn't listen to me, so I just started recording it while you were talking shit on Brandon's show. <laughs> I wasn't talking. Oh yeah, I he mean, said he's yeah, doing we the were. Show. I don't know why I'm lying about that. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, we're talking blatant <laughs> the, shit. The one guy lower on the totem pole. <laughs> <laughs> the, the end of the material human centipede, Brandon Wardell, <laughs> the guy that writes behind Adam. Did we joke on the sh- on the show? I yet? am lowest on the bill for did, that show. Did, did we? Do we talk? You deserve it. Yet yeah, a, about <laughs> <laughs> about what? About how much that Japanese guy at the back of the human centipede would have loved that shit, <laughs> <laughs> and they like pretend like he doesn't like it in the movie. I didn't. I never saw a human centipede. Oh yeah, it's two hot girls and then a Japanese guy. <laughs> oh really? Yeah, who's yeah. in the nice. middle? I think. Does he ever get the? Or fuck maybe them? you know what? Maybe he's in the front with his mouth. Oh, that's funny. I don't know, but you I'd know, love to be in the front. You know, you know, he would like the German scientists would be telling him his plans, and he would be like, "Thank you, <laughs> <laughs> thank you for this gift to me, <laughs> delicious. <laughs> this is the only thing I have ever dreamed of, <laughs> is to be sewed together." <laughs> to, to the front of the human centipede's not bad. Yeah, you, what, you don't have to eat anything. Me and Cubist were talking about it one time. It's like, what's the worst? What's the ranking? Yeah, best to worst. And then, like, there's all this, all these people we were talking to that were like, you know, oh well, you know, the front's obviously the most ideal, and then probably the back, and then the middle. And it's like, no, do you get it's first the front, then the middle, then the hundred percent? I'm at least getting at the least shit you're getting your ass eaten. Yeah, and you sh- shitting in someone's you mouth. You want to shit in someone's <laughs> yeah, yeah, mouth yeah. at the very least. <laughs> yeah, right. That's a consolation prize. <laughs> I would say that the front is almost good. The front's great. Yeah. <laughs> That's a good thing to happen it's to you. It's funny. Yeah. Because you're the only one not suffering your whole life. is just like uh, shit. Like, imagine if I was in the front and Adam was behind me, you know how happy I'd be? Why? Every day, yeah. my, you're just eating my shit. It's funny. I wouldn't last that long. Mm-hmm. I'd probably Wait, die. How did they die in that movie? From, from eating sepsis. shit. Oh, oh, from literally from just from the shit, shit people <laughs> accuse me of having. <laughs> You don't have it anymore. Who accuses you of I that? I don't know. That's like a that's like a meme. People on the boards. Yeah, <laughs> dude, I have. <laughs> Nick's got. Yeah, sepsis. people on Game Facts keep saying <laughs> that I have sepsis. Dude, I had a rough week this week. You ever use Game Facts? I no. never did. I did. I've never. I don't know how any board works at all. Yeah, I've never used I form. got to the internet much too late. We got it when well, I, I just was used like, it for porn, dude. I never dude, used I it never for. Got, no, I never. I still don't understand how it works. Like I tried to go on Reddit once. I don't get it. Oh, I, I don't understand Reddit. how it works. Well, but yeah, it's kind never, of its own thing. That's different. Aren't aren't all boards that way though? It's like there are moderators. And shit, yeah, and there's there's like sub and people shit. vote for your like if it's good comment Isn't that what or every bad board comment. Is? No, so. they don't have the voting stuff. Oh no, okay. Yeah. Is that Reddit? Is the upvote down? Yeah, vote? yeah, yeah. Sometimes I've tried to like get on other like boards where I'm like researching something, and I just. I'm too stupid to understand the board, so it's like I'm not going to figure out how to... Boards are kind of an old thing, I feel like. Yeah, it's like email. It's like not knowing how email works. I, well, I get email, but not boards, man. I don't yeah, know what to tell okay. you. I'm dumb. I'm an old man. Because I didn't get internet in my house. I had dial-up when I was like, I don't know, in freshman year of high school, ninth grade. Yeah. And we didn't get high-speed internet until I was like in 10th grade yeah, you could use grade. forms with dial-up. Yeah, you don't need, like, AOL, download dude. speeds. I had AOL at home or whatever the fuck. The only thing I used it for was AIM I got, my mom, beating my off mom, to... My mom yeah. still had dial-up until, like, four years ago. <laughs> no way. Yeah, she just <laughs> refused Who even to provides switch. dial-up? She would get into, like, fights with Verizon because they would, like, be like, we're going to cut off your service. <laughs> <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. What well, was dial after dial up? DSL, smoothie. right? Yeah, yeah DSL. Oh yeah. Dick sucking lips. Yeah, that's what it stands nice. for. Man, this I'm getting sluggish after this smoothie. I ate a giant steak yesterday. I saw that. I was jealous. I know. I made it myself. How'd you do it? I seared it. I used salt and pepper. You, you got know? a cast iron? Yeah. Well, Amber does. I used hers. Nice. I would nice. uh, use some butter and a little bit of, uh, what's that, thyme. 
Yeah. Yes, time is good. Put a little bit. If of your time dick is really pan. big, what you do is you put the fucking you put the pan at five hundred degrees in the in fucking the oven. Well, after to you get sear it, it screaming hot. No, 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 no. To get it hot as shit, and then you you put the fucking heat high. Throw the fucking pan that's already been in the oven. Iron. Yeah. Put yeah. that fucker on on there for like ninety seconds each side. Mm, I mean, the, the 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 pan gets pretty fucking hot, and you just need to sear it for like uh, about two minutes each side. I mean, yeah. cooking a steak's pretty Depends easy. Depends on what cut of steak it is. You got to go ribeye. If you're going straight, yeah, ribeye. Ribeye, yeah. the fatty shit. That's dude. my yeah. favorite. Yeah. Hell yeah. Get that marbleization popping. Let's yeah. get a fucking ribeye. We got to get boysters, and we got to get a fucking we ribeye. We still need to go to Peter, Peter Luger's Steakhouse. Fuck yeah, dude. I went with Ben. Let's go. Let's I'm go. Down. Let's run it back. I'm down to try though, a different Yeah, ones. I remember. I was trying to come, and you were like, no, actually, it's just me and Ben going. Yeah, sometimes. Because they had a reservation, Nick. People can have plans that don't involve you, Nick. He's no, so, not going to eat. I know he's Ben. such a baby no, about this me stuff. Me and Ben... Ben's like one of my best friends. We live in different cities. I see him fucking six times a year. Also, they made a reservation for two. It was said he was like, "I'm coming. We're getting steaks." And he had no point to say that they made a reservation for. There two. was a he reservation. said he had a six p.m. reservation with at Peter Luger's with Ben. Oh, did you go? Is that how you know? Yeah, Adam no, was there. I, I, I invited my friends I like. <laughs> it was me, Adam, Ben. And then we could uh, only add one Brandon. more person. Yeah, to the reservation. Brandon Wardell skyped in. Yeah. <laughs> we had Darcy was there. That Darcy. girl Darcy hates. Yeah, uh, yeah Eve. Bob was there. <laughs> yeah. Brandon, it was uh, really cool. Uh, Eve was telling everyone she's Jewish. <laughs> the whole restaurant loved it. They're like, hey, you got to get a load of this girl. She's hilarious. She's telling us she's Jewish. Have you ever heard such a funny joke in your life? Yeah, so otherwise, though, you know, I'd be happy to have involved you. But you get it. It was a close personal thing. Yeah, Brandon ordered fidget spinners. <laughs> he, he ordered fucking chicken nuggets at a steakhouse. Um, but we should go get steaks for real and boysters to celebrate. Um, to, well, there's a lot of reason to celebrate today. Yeah. It's Donald Trump's birthday, is it? Yes. It's Flag Day. It's uh, it's Flag Day. Um, Adam's got a couple of rainbow flags set up around his house. <laughs> That's his flag. A couple. <laughs> I got it's like the United Nations over at my house. Yeah, just a hundred different rainbow flags. <laughs> yeah. It's different. Ra- you got the rainbow version of every f- country. Every flag. country, exactly. One, every time you suck off a guy from a different country, he gives you one of those. Well, I got actually just uh, fifty mm-hmm. of the Israel rainbow <laughs> flags. We've had a couple of good shootings today. The one at UPS, and I've feuded with UPS numerous times. <laughs> Anytime. Any Anything bad happens to one of their <laughs> transit centers. <laughs> Amen. God bless. <laughs> that was pretty cool. Bernie what Bro. Happened? The Bernie yeah, Bro. Bernie Bro shot up a bunch of... Uh, Congressman playing softball. Which is like, you know, which, yeah. it's like, good, right? Yeah. If, if you're, if you're good... I'm just like, if you're going to be some fucking old asshole playing baseball... Fuck baseball. Well, how dude. many you deserve to get right. shot? How many dudes? Baseball's gay, dude. <laughs> how many? Yeah. If you're, if you're a fucking senator, fucking fielding balls and shit. Get the fuck out of here. How you're many eighty years with old? Ninety guns that they got at gun shows that aren't registered that were stockpiling to take arms against the government had to backtrack today. Like a million, probably. Yeah, it is strange that it's a Bernie bro. I mean, shouts out, you know. Aha! Uh-huh. You know it's it, it, we're, we're getting in, we're getting brother. in the mass shooting game. You know what I mean? Yeah. We're 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 getting. You know, it wasn't just being uh, chauvinist. That wasn't enough. It wasn't enough being mean to ladies. Now we're shooting people too, dude. We're getting in the game. Yeah. So, and there was also a, a a big fire in London, which was pretty cool. Was there? It, yeah, it was uh, a Muslim fire. A Muslim uh, apartment <laughs> complex that burned down. Oh shit! So, yeah, you know what? Chalk went up for the good guys. <laughs> Take that. <laughs> that's, a, that's how I feel. So for today, you would say it's it kind of evens out because it does. You're a beautiful Republican senator got shot. I'm so glad. But a Muslim. No, also I'm on. Died. I'm on board with the Bernie bro shooting. People. Okay, you're you're on every. You're so on it's, a, every it's a good board. day. Yeah, you're yeah. game facts. Every, every act yeah. of violence, you're pro today. One hundred percent. I'm you know? I'm pro. I'm also I'm pro Donald baseball. Trump's birthday. Yeah, yeah. And Flag Day. <laughs> um. Yeah, I'm anti baseball. Fuck, I didn't even know there was a UPS one. Yeah, the UPS one just happened. Isn't that kind of like hack the po- going postal? Oh, there's a shooting at the Barclays no, Center. No, it's a today. shitty job. Actually, you know what? It's not. UPS guys are teamsters, and like even the dickheads that stand yeah, around. Yeah, it's not the, bad. They make Flanagan like fucking eighteen dollars okay an hour. Right? Yeah. Yeah, we had a family friend who was a pilot for UPS, and he was fucking loaded. A pilot? Yeah. Yeah. Well, what postal Dog, workers? I would love to yeah, be a mailman. Honestly, they're not teamsters. That shit would be tight. You get what? little shorts. 
You had to walk around all fucking day, little yeah. cardio. You got to do a shit ton of squats, though, because you, if you squats, cool. if you, imagine Adam's legs going around. A, What's wrong with my legs? Yeah, Adam has horrible little bitch ass legs. Of yeah. course, at least I have hair on my legs. I have hair. First of all, stops. You legs barely are so have fat, hair on your legs. That's not why. That <laughs> yeah, the hair is inside the fat. The, hair is, <laughs> the fat wrapped it around his hair. He got sucked in <laughs> like the end of a piece of spaghetti into a mouth. <laughs> yeah. It's like when there's still little pieces of feathers on uh, chicken fat. You know what I mean? That's oh, that's the worst. <laughs> um, I have beautiful fucking gams. You a actually do have really powerful legs. Good musculature. It's no, it's no wonder why you have really powerful legs. How many fat guys have you seen with skinny legs, bitch? Never. Okay? A lot, a you lot win. have skinny yeah, ass legs. I am a fuck. I'm a. I'm an athletic specimen, and that's what. And you're. You're. You know what I mean? I, like I, I agree. You have nice legs, and so Thank do you. I, and so does Nick. You we do all not. Have nice you legs. have horrible legs. Why? Why? I thought we were the nice leg boys. No, I Nick, that was Nick has thing. okay legs, but he okay works legs. on them. You. You have entitlement. You think I have, just, I have? I have. I don't have. I wish my calves were bigger. Yeah. It's. It's. That's one of the. Most embarrassing things yeah, in the world. It's, to go it throughout, is. throughout this life <laughs> yeah. without meaty calves. Yeah, that's that Mil- That was Milhouse's thing in uh, that future episode where Lisa is marrying that British guy. Yeah. Milhouse gets jacked and he can't get his calves going. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. You're future Milhouse, bitch. <laughs> Damn. And you're I'm present just, Milhouse. I'm just saving up for the implants. No, no the, my legs are Lisa. nice, but I just... Yeah. <laughs> I choose to sit. You are kind of the Lisa Simpson of the podcast. Why? Because I'm good if at Lisa school was and saxophone? Stupid. Yeah, because you like chime in with some bullshit that, yeah. you know. What do you mean some bullshit? The Take worst a- character on the show. <laughs> Lisa's the worst? I'm the best. I'm Homer. Dude, you're the AJ Soprano of our podcast. No, I, I'm yeah. not. I'm, I'm the Homer Tony. Simpson. You're I'm the Tony Homer Soprano. Simpson? You're the girl from Gilligan that we talked about last week that they all fuck. Not, me- not the hot one, the other one. And Nick Which is one? Homer. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's the podcast. I'm Tony Soprano. <laughs> Nick is Homer, and you're the brunette you're Lisa, from Gilligan's you're Island. Lisa, you're Lisa from Gilligan's Island. <laughs> that's not true at all. I reject that. I reject all of that. Man, Nick, you can't be Homer. Homer's never been rude Homer's to too. anyone ever. What? what? He's you, not rude. You, so, are you? Is that a serious thing? It's serious. You don't think yeah. Homer? What the fuck are you talking about? Who's he rude to? Literally what? everybody. He's, Flanders. He has no so I guess he's <laughs> Flanders, Flanders is the nicest guy in the world and he's he's a piece of shit. <laughs> no, nah, Flanders Homer's is a piece never of been shit. rude. <laughs> That's like a, a central part of the character. <laughs> well, Even Bart, he doesn't mean to be he's fucking stupid. And well yeah, he has no social graces. But Nick is on purpose. I've literally rude. modeled my personality yeah. after Homer Simpson. No, you yeah. haven't. Yes, I have. Someone no, who's haven't. rude and doesn't understand why he's being rude. You don't think that doesn't remind you of anyone in this fucking room right now? Okay, Nick, you're right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you're Lisa. <laughs> Why am I Lisa? She's smart. She's good at school. You're Lisa if she wasn't smart. She has Liberty Spike hair. hair That's dude. one of my favorite jokes, though, again, back to Millhouse is when someone calls Millhouse a nerd and he's like, I'm not a nerd. Nerds are smart. <laughs> 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 Yeah, we're I'm watching the, Indiana Jones. And I'm the Ralph me, Wiggum. It's making me want to revisit the hat store. Dude, we got to go back. Indiana Jones sucks, by the way. Yeah, we had a nice day yeah, at that hat as, store. You know, I've tried to like these movies a million times, and they're just fucking boring. Yeah. It's just fucking slow, and... I like the one like that's the racist racism, to Asian. Other what, than who's that. the Asian kid in the second one? Short round? Yeah. I yeah. like that Daka one. Jones! <laughs> Daka Jones, he fucked my ass! <laughs> Not now, short round. I don't have time to listen to your stories about getting fucked in the ass. <laughs> that's, now that's a movie. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, how old is Harrison Ford? That motherfucker's still flying he's planes. He's like old. 77 years old. Isn't, isn't he like always in a crashing and shit? Yeah, yeah. he's still fucking. He's and he, still is, he was fucking I'm out taking in the my field? private yeah. plane to Southeast Asia <laughs> so I can go fuck short round. <laughs> I forget. <laughs> Pedophile Indiana Jones. <laughs> yeah. No, I think I, I did it like tweet like five or six years ago. That That's was when Twitter was fun. With uh, with uh, Indiana Jones looking at Short Round's ass and he goes, uh, <laughs> this belongs in a museum. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Hell yeah. Hell yeah, Short Round. Oh, yeah, fuck. who was also... Uh, oh. It was uh, Data in fucking Goonies. Oh, was he? I yeah. think so. It's the yeah, same. Was. They only had one was he Chinese. The, was he the guy that was then. also in? Uh, He's the 80s in the Chinese Molly Ringwald boy. movie. Uh, Long, Long Dong. Dong. Long Dong. 
So, uh, 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 no, yeah, it's it was Jackie Chan. <laughs> That's how Jackie Chan got his start. <laughs> I'm a sixteen candles. I'm a huge Jackie Chan fan. No one can say anything bad about that guy to me. Um, he's gay and he's a bitch. Please do not say that to me. <laughs> and you're actually a bigger bitch than him. If Jackie Chan, although you know what, you know what, that fucking cartoon, I love that. Fucking yeah, Jackie, Jackie Chan, Chan Adventures. Adventures. Jackie Chan Adventures, so rules. good. Niece, yeah, because he's so good. Jackie Chan reproduces asexually. <laughs> That's right. That's why he doesn't look like he's aged. We're actually on Jackie number seven. <laughs> he just lays an egg, and then a, a smaller Jackie Chan comes out of it. And eventually, when they reach the same height, five foot two, they replace <laughs> the old Jackie Chan with the new one. Whatever. All those Jackies do their own stunts, dude. Yeah, dude, wasn't dude, he also in porn? Him and Stallone did porn before they got famous, right? With Stallone each other. did soft yeah. porn. <laughs> <laughs> That's one hundred percent true. Jackie Chan. Did did Where'd you get that from? I think he did. Is no, Vin Diesel Locky. did, didn't he? Huh? Shh. Locky, Locky Balboa. Locky, uh, there we go. <laughs> yeah, Barboa, dude. Yeah. Come on. Fit it, dude. Come on. Dot all your eyes and cross all your T's, yeah, dude. That was, that was weak. <laughs> Pull all your eyes back and <laughs> cross all your lawns. <laughs> and and get all your green T's. <laughs> your oolong T's. Did, uh, did, what's his name? Uh, Vin Diesel do gay porn or something? Didn't someone what? Say? Yeah. Well, it was a hobby, like, privately. <laughs> aside from all the Fast and the Furious movies. He, yeah, he did gay porn the way you do gay porn. Yeah. I know that Stallone was, like, living, he was homeless. All the time. He was homeless. For sexual living, gratification. Living at the, uh, the Port Authority bus station. Yeah, I've seen that viral video. He had to sell his dog or whatever. And he uh, saw Fuck an ad for a softcore porn. Yeah, and who's then he, buying dogs from homeless people? I know, I know <laughs> exactly. Who the fuck bought it? That that story is that dog died, and he didn't want to say he had his dog killed. And I watched uh, the founder the other night. What that about? It's about uh, Ray Kroc. Oh Ray yeah, Kumpf. that was on the plane. I didn't watch it. The though. founder of Crocs. Yeah, he found it. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. the McDonald. It was Keaton. made by Mario. Well, it was funny. There is a scene in the movie where he's like. He's like, the, why he went with McDonald's, he's like, that's such a great name. Who's going to buy something called Croc? <laughs> that's a fun little dig at that dumbass shoe was company. Was it good? Um, it was all right, I guess. Didn't he, like, fuck someone over? Isn't that the Yeah, story? he fucked everyone over. Nice. He didn't invent anything. And, nice. But it's like, we were arguing about it the other night. It, like that's, that's, like, not even a unique story in American business. Yeah, that's every, every successful business Pretty much. That, yeah. yeah, dude. Microsoft was entirely, like, just Bill Gates. The Winklevoss, right? The Winklevoss. Yeah. Uh, the Winklevoss has invented Microsoft. <laughs> yeah. And Bill Gates stole the idea from him. Yeah, well, when you have such a fucking charismatic fucking frontman as Bill Gates, imagine being such a nerd that Bill picture. Gates out charisma you. <laughs> the picture of Bill we Gates. We didn't out charisma. What he did is he, he bought he bought the operating system that was DOS, rebranded it, and then fucking uh, uh, sold licensed it to IBM rather than just mm. giving it to them to use yep. on all their machines. And then when other companies started making IBM clones, like he was able to. You know, license which I think was already too. happening prior to DOS being big, but yeah. he was able to license it to all those different companies. What did DOS stand for? Money. Um, dick sucking uh, lips. <laughs> nice. Dick yeah. on suck mand. Like command. Um, that's chill. I watched uh, the <laughs> I watched the, the fucking uh, Logan movie on the plane. Logan, yes, and my the bitch. Oasis documentary. And the Oasis documentary was hilarious. Yeah, yeah, they're it, like such bad boys. They're like doing like hard drugs and stuff, and their music just sounds so gay. It's yeah. just like, it's like oh, I love you. The, they're yeah. just like doing crystal method. Like I fucking hate my brother. Like yeah, it's so funny. Those guys are hilarious. You all get sucked off in the meadow. Yeah. In a champagne supernova. Yeah, I've only heard uh, "Closing Time." That's the only Oasis. That's song Eagle Eye Cherry. Oh, oh no, no, that's not. That's <laughs> is it? No, it's not Eagle Eye Cherry. Who is that? Buck Cherry. Well, yeah. it's not Buck Cherry. Yeah, it's Buck Cherry. <laughs> <laughs> that's gonna be my da the father daughter dance at my daughter's You're wedding. You're a crazy bitch. Crazy bitch. <laughs> <laughs> that would be so Who is funny. "Closing Time"? Uh, oh, uh, OAR? Fastball? No, that's uh, the road. Tom Petty and the Heartbreakers. Come on, dude. <laughs> Closing time. No, it's a one-hit wonder. Tom Petty and the Dick Suckers. Your knowledge of music, you're like you listen to what like an uncle listens to. No, I don't. I don't he listen likes, to that shit. He likes rap. Oh yeah, I listen to rap. Um, it was Yo Gotti, <clears throat> who wrote Closing Time. That's crazy that I none don't of know. us know. Damn. Yeah. 
Butch Third is- Eye Blind? No. No. <laughs> I don't fucking know. It's some gay ass band. Yeah, I that mean song that song sucks. sucks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the fuck is like listening to closing time. It's a gimmick song to yeah. put on. The closing. They time. literally wrote it like maybe they'll put this on <laughs> at closing <laughs> time. Yeah, and we can get those fucking uh, <laughs> yeah. uh, those ass cap fees. And <laughs> yeah. restaurants play this bullshit. <clears throat> fucking Who the fuck time. Wrote it? Yeah. I'm really upset right now. Yeah, there, there's like, a, I'm taking a cab in New York City, <laughs> and it's, you know, please tip your driver. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> it's my rock song that I'm, I came up with. Every new begin- ending is a- another motherfucker's cock. That's good. You know? I'm n- I've heard the song maybe, I, d- I know who I want to suck me off. You know, um, have you ever fucked at closing time, Adam? Like a like a hail mary, throwing a hail mary at closing time from the fucked? bar. From the bar. No, that's not how I fool girls into having sex. With yeah, me. I've never fucked off a bar. Yeah, Nicholas, I have once or twice. Um, yeah, once or yeah, once in Austin. Yeah, that's the only place you can really do that. Yeah, play, you, It's got to be somewhere like I mean, that. that's like Austin, that's York. the only New York thing that City. New York you do it. Oh yeah, 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 sure. Yeah, I guess yeah. I don't drink here. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, I, I kind of stopped drinking too. Drinking really helps you just kind of like fill in the gaps that your personality and fucking nerve yeah. uh, fall short at. Yeah, it is sort of like a, a stain you can pour over <laughs> yeah, yeah. the porous surface of your psyche. <laughs> yeah. Just let it fill in all the gaps. And yeah, dude. You're just fucking. You just putting your arm around fucking bitches, grabbing titties and shit. Yeah, I, you're becoming do you a rapist. Do you that consensually? <laughs> yeah. You rape? Uh, that's you not drink? me. No. That's the beer assaulting. <laughs> no, it's a fun time. You're getting your dick grabbed by drunk women, which happens to me all the time. Really? Oh yeah. The Get only nice people that have ever yeah, I feel like with my the big dick fat guy, guys. people like don't think that you have boundaries. Right, it's true. Yeah, like, yeah. Oh, look how fat he is. He must be comfortable with his body. I can just yeah. touch him and do whatever I, I want. Know. I know. People yeah, they touch like bald people's heads and shit. Absolutely. Imagine doing that to a fat woman. <laughs> just kind of like, whoa, oink, 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 oink. <laughs> go, 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 look, go. How, look how brave you are. <laughs> just on the bus. <laughs> how do many people, purple hearts do you have, ma'am? Do people expect fat fat men to be happy? <laughs> Is that like a... Oh, everyone wants like a jolly, stereotype? Everyone wants a jolly fat, fat guy. No one wants a... F- it's, it was a struggle, dude. You're really you know, I was a moody, fat guy. I was a moody fat boy, but society fucking molded me into Yeah, jolly. but you can be a moody fat boy. You just have to be like into insane clown posse no, and shit. No, I couldn't do that. Yeah. yeah, you have to do like face makeup yeah. if you're a moody I fat went, guy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have to a lot, go of, a lot of hand gestures. Absolutely. A lot of doing... Or be a wigger. Be like an angry, fat, white guy wigger. Yeah. Yeah, but those guys all That's think like they're the hot. Violent J. <laughs> yeah. Big J. <laughs> Violent J. Ogerson? <laughs> wow, how did that take us that long? That was good. Violent J. Ogerson. That was good. <laughs> Someone get that Photoshop going. Um, yeah, no, I was definitely, I definitely went into the fucking job. Oh, these fucking special effects suck dick. I've never seen this part. It's good for like the 80s. I guess, but it ain't the 80s no more, dude. I'm not trying to watch George Mike and play center. You know what, what I'm movies That's that what I'm are talking old? about, dude? I want I want <laughs> fucking computer graphics yeah. in all my movies. Blade Runner Tree of looks Life. Good. Let's throw Actually, it out. You know what? Let's put this, it in the garbage. This Let's part is it all good. with anime. What the old movies? Are anime. Actually, these little lightning bolts are kind of tight. Yeah, that's cool. I do fuck with this. Oh shit! Let's watch the guy's face melt. Yeah, the let's Nazi do the podcast and say. Oh, yeah, yeah. You're right. All right, yeah. What yeah. what older? This is a good question. What older movies? Like from the eighties, look good still. Like Blade, with, like, Runner. Blade, Blade Runner. Runner looks I was about like to say, awesome. yeah. Blade Runner still looks good. I saw like um, the original the, set. Yeah, Star Wars looks good. It does. Yeah. Yeah. It does. The Adventures uh, of Ford Fairline. Do you guys know that movie? No. It's the Andrew Dice Clay movie. No. <laughs> Dude, <laughs> it's like a fucking stop. rockabilly <laughs> Andrew Dice Clay movie. Wow, he's a great actor. I. I Dude, have, have we talked about the new the show? Wait, is there, show? Sp- is there special effects in that movie? No, you just mentioned it because because it's dice. It's a movie. Yeah, and because I don't know that movie. That's like the only the movie you've seen that me and Adam haven't seen. <laughs> I haven't I seen it because it's an Andrew Dice. I haven't Play seen it. Movie. I've seen like thirty percent of it. Oh, okay. I couldn't get a good stream. Stop! You um, are a cinephile. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> um, <laughs> dropping these Criterion collections. Let's see. Like, what have I seen from the eighties? Do you call it Criterion? Criterion. Cri- criterion. 
All right. bitch. Um, That's not what you said the first time. Dude, I I know I do A that. League of Their Own? Is that the 80s? Yeah. What? There's no special effects in <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, That's they had to movie, Photoshop though. all the... They was all men playing. <laughs> they had to Except Photoshop for Rosie. Photoshop women faces. It was <laughs> men and Rosie. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it was just men and Rosie. <laughs> Dude, she's made for softball. Have you seen uh, Riding the Bus with My Sister? No. no. The Rosie O'Donnell movie where she plays a mentally retarded woman. Oh, yes. And it's, like, offensive. That's awesome. As, to me, as somebody that is an advocate for that community, I was, like, mortified when I saw <laughs> it. <laughs> um, yeah, she does this weird voice. She's like, we're going to the store to buy a new toilet seat. <laughs> <laughs> All retarded people talk like cartoon dogs. <laughs> 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 yeah, yeah. This is a dog wearing overalls. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> we gotta go to the store. <laughs> yeah, it's really bad. No, and, let's and, watch it. And you shit. watch it, and you're like, "Fuck, this must have been like early in her career." And it's from like 2007. No oh, way. Oh yeah, it's from like way later. It's than post Rosie awesome. O'Donnell show. Wow. It's, it's like yeah. much later than you thought. It'd the be. Rosie Show, bitch. My favorite. I love that as a comeback concept for her that she's gonna go tarred. Yeah, that was my shit. That was my post. That was my after school viewing. Was that fucking Rosie O'Donnell show? Dude. I know you've seen <laughs> the Koosh balls. It's so funny. Fuck uh, yeah! You, you were sad when you found out she was she gay. Was gay. I, was sad. <laughs> I was religious as a little kid. <laughs> yeah. You prayed for her. Prayed Did you want to marry gay. Rosie O'Donnell? <laughs> huh? I remember being sad when I found out Nathan Lane was gay. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. <laughs> I was like, oh no. <laughs> but he's such a nice guy. <laughs> he's also like the gayest, the gayest guy man the- of all time. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, yeah. Half the movies he's in, he's gay as hell. Right, yeah. No, this is funny. It's like a kid, you don't know what again. gay is, so there's like just guys you bad. just think that are like good at entertaining children. <laughs> yeah. Like Tim Curry or Mr. Rogers or, you know. Barney, the the dinosaurs game. Yeah, oh, absolutely. For sure. Do you remember that rumor? Tele- the purple Teletubby? That rumor about Steve from Blue's Clues that he like raped a kid and they had to get rid of him? No, he just lost his hair. No, he had a one-man show for a while. Yeah. And he recorded an album. It's like not true, but I remember everyone was like, "Dude, that guy, that guy Steve from Blues Clues." But he was on drugs or some shit, right? No, he yeah, w- that's right. He became a heroin and addict. And he went bald, dude. Yeah, yeah. There's plenty of old movies that look great. Poor bald oh, in guy. fact, as I feel bad gets, for guys to go bald. It's increasingly shot on like digital rather than film. Like, it looks a lot better. It's going to look b- a much better because they're going to start doing like better rescans of old film. Mm-hmm. The and Sting. The Sting is like one of the best movies. That fucking of all movie time. rules. Yeah, it's a great movie. I've seen it, and it rules. Yeah, have not seen Butch Cassidy and the Sundance Kid though. Wow. Well, Sting is good enough. <laughs> you know, Sting in the movie, the Sting, wrestler, the wrestler. Um, not the musician. He's terrible. He's the worst one of all the by stings. far. Yeah. Yeah. Are Dude, there the any other Stings? Suck. The police are a really fucking bad band. Roxanne, you don't have to suck off my hard dick. The only good police song is the Suck off my heart, dick. The Yale Yale song. Yeah. No, that's 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 <laughs> from the Desert Rose. From yeah, the yeah. Jaguar commercial. That was big when I went to Greece and like Desert Rose was. Oh hell yeah. When I was a little I was a little kid and I went to Greece and I was I was bumping that shit, dude. Riding up winding Greek roads with no fuck they got no fucking um We should all move to Greece. I'm going. You got motherfuckers should come, dude. I'm going for a couple weeks in oh, uh, September. Multiplicities. I love here. that movie. Multiplicity. Yeah, yeah. never seen it. <clears throat> Michael Keaton as a retard. He also plays a retard. No, in that he's movie. not retarded. He clones himself. One of the clones is retarded. Is oh, retarded. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> uh, and they like set that up in the movie. They're like, "Now be careful! If you clone a clone, it'll be retarded." <laughs> and then it's like, I wonder if that's going to happen at some point in this movie. I think he's one of like the all-time coolest guys. Keaton Michael rules. Keaton. Yeah. He was yeah. a stand-up. Yeah, he, he a, was yeah. from Pittsburgh because he had a holding yeah. deal, and the comp- whoever the fuck he was with wasn't putting him in any movies, so he started doing stand-up, and he was good at it. And they let him be Batman. Yeah, that he's a comic rules. that they I let love that become guy, man. Batman. Yeah, I want to I love Keaton. him so much. I'm yeah. like the Michael Keaton of the group. Nah, it's me. I'm you're no, the Michael Keaton. You're like the you're Val Kilmer. Clone. You're Val Kilmer. I'm Michael Keaton. No, I'm Michael Keaton. I, I'm also Val Kilmer. I would be <laughs> Val Kilmer. I think is a is a fucking special talent. I think he's a genius. What? I think he's amazing. Yeah, Are yeah. Are you trolling? No, I'm serious. I'm in what serious. sense is he? What? I think he's. I think he's, he's been incredible good in, in a everything. Of, uh, he's movies. good. I think he's great in everything. Uh, the Saints, one of the greatest <laughs> movies. Of I love that movie. I've never seen that. 
I've he's seen a, that he's movie this a guy that's times. like a thief that uses all the different names of the saints as cover <laughs> identities. It's a bad movie, but he's tight, uh, dude. Also, those names are the most common names <laughs> yeah, of all yeah. time. My name is uh, Santa Claus. <laughs> yeah. I don't know yeah. where the diamonds are. <laughs> yeah, after you get through <laughs> Matthew, John, <laughs> Luke, and the other one. I think he's a special being touched by yeah. God. I don't know. Seriously. I don't know, Chief. Some guy who said his name was Thomas Aquinas. <laughs> <laughs> said... He needed to hold the bank's money. <laughs> oh, um, fuck. Yeah, dude, did, he was in uh, MacGruber. He was great in MacGruber. Which is a slept on MacGruber one rules. of the funniest movies of the last 10 years. MacGruber's funny People don't shit. give it enough credit. Um, Ryan all the, Phillippe. All the movies that those guys have done, I think, are fucking yeah, awesome. I agree. The with Lonely that. Island guys. I agree. Hot Rod was you guys ever fuck great. With, do you guys ever fuck with the website, the Lonely Island website? Before Andy saying. Before they got Berg SNL, was on SNL. Yeah. I used to fuck with that shit. Well, they had a pilot that is now online. You can see that called yeah. Awesome Town. I remember in college we'd watch that. A m- a oh, bunch. I remember that. Yeah, my yeah. name is your motherfucker, the sensitive one. Yeah. Uh, break your motherfucking face with, with the, the butt, butt of, of my gun. gun. <laughs> yeah. Uh, rip off your arms and slap your. Uh, pull out my dick and fuck your ass with them. Something like that. I don't know. I I like those guys because they're like very much. I feel like. Sort of similar to me as like Sandler kids. They're Jews. No, no. People that like grew up on Sandler. If, like, you're like if you were funny. You don't mean Jews. They're like if you were funny is what you're saying. Yeah, if I was funny. If you and had any comedic talent. Yeah, if I had like good timing <laughs> yeah. and funny jokes yeah. and friends that were supportive of my ideas. <laughs> you had two friends that you had a successful creative what endeavor ideas? with. <laughs> what, what, what fucking ideas? ideas are we supposed to be supportive of? <laughs> All of my ideas. I've, 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 I've Name pit- one. Pitch one. All right, let's do this. This will be a pitch Name meeting. one idea that isn't just you stealing something from somebody. <laughs> <laughs> stop you couldn't that. even get through it. <laughs> stop that. You stop All that right, right now. Go ahead, pitch. Pitch what? Pitch. Pitch an idea. I don't want to say it on the pod because people are going to take it. Okay, here's one. We're all fucking centaurs. Okay. Okay. That's a good idea. Um, your, your horse dies, PETA comes for your lower half <laughs> because you're abusing it with your fucking torso. <laughs> <laughs> you, go to, you go to jail for animal abuse. I got an idea. Yeah, and you guys got to break me out. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I got an idea, okay? Okay. I'm a kid that grew up like super poor, right? Mm-hmm. Like one of the poorest kids in yeah, like yeah, in yeah. the country, what right? are you a janitor or something? And you no. do a fucking math no. problem. Is no. this what you're gonna do? No, you're gonna Stop. take the plot Stop. of something else. Yeah. Stop. And Go his ahead. toys yeah. come to life yeah. when he's yeah. not around. <laughs> And he Stop goes to it. college and his toys have to go Oh my him. god, can I just pitch my idea? It's called Toy Story. <laughs> Has anyone done that? What are some other... And you've uh, got an old on? wooden dreidel that's yeah, your favorite. Here's an idea. A cowboy dreidel. Befriend Dan Deacon and you Star asked me. <laughs> <laughs> you asked me Maybe for an idea. Maybe we can do some stuff on Adult Swim. Okay, okay, okay. okay. What's your, you're the poorest kid in the world. I'm the, one of the poorest kids in the country. Uh-huh. And then I get... I get to go on Who Wants to Be a Millionaire. <laughs> okay. Oh, so you're and literally... all the questions this make is me just... think of stories from my life. Okay. Slumdog Millionaire. We got it. You're what doing exactly what, what we said. <laughs> I've never heard Didn't of that. Didn't we talk about Slumdog Millionaire last time? I don't know. We I thought we... it was that was a movie about Indians dancing. <laughs> they dance in it. That was a very confusing movie for me. <laughs> hey, me at the boogie. Do you guys remember Punjabi MC? I don't know if I've seen Slumdog Millionaire. I haven't seen it. Do they blind children in that movie? No, he's like an untouchable. What's the Indian movie where they pour boiling water in children's eyes? Aladdin. Yeah, it is a lot. I don't know. I don't know. No, I, I, that's the movie I saw, and I thought it was some dog millionaire. <laughs> is that a real movie? Yeah, dude. There's like these Indian street kids, and people will snatch him up, and they the pour with the boiling tiger? water in their fucking eyeballs. So Life they... of Pi? No. What Fuck. other Indian movies are there? Shit. I don't um, know. Bollywood? Yeah, like, uh... I seriously <laughs> thought that was some dog millionaire. You did? It's about a call center. <laughs> is it called... There's a bunch of people that work in a call center and there's Indian kids getting their eyes pulled out. <laughs> nah, that's not it. Are Damn. You, you um, that maybe one? that's my own original idea. Yeah, it's that, much better than that. Hey, now we're movie. doing Now we got no, it's not original, dude. That was Brandon's idea, actually. That's good. Um, I got one. Okay. Hit hit us. Okay. You guys ready for this? Mm-hmm. Yeah. All right. There's a... I play like a New York City cab driver. <laughs> okay. Right? Mm-hmm. I'm just sick of all Are the... you foreign? Are you foreign? Do you no, say no. thank you very much? No, I'm like a Italian kind of guy. Okay. 
Okay. I'm just sick of How all about, that. here's a, it's, oh. a, it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a <laughs> biopic oh, about Adam's life. Ernest Borgnine plays Adam. He goes to jail for raping an eight-year-old Korean girl. And while in prison, while being violently sodomized as payback, uh-huh. he befriends a Muslim guy. Mm. And then they try and solve Israel-Palestine from prison. From prison. From prison. By being gay with each other. <laughs> But it turns out the and guy was a terrorist all along. Yeah, and it's the guy from a, the night of. <laughs> yeah. Rez, Rez, Rez Ahmed. Ahmed. The He's problem cool. is that Ernest Borgnine has a no gay sex clause in his contract. <laughs> so you get a double. <laughs> yeah. You get an Ernest okay, Borgnine Okay, if we double. can't get Borgnine, who do we get to play Adam? Someone I gay. Don't know. He's Jewish. probably uh, he's five old Finkelstein. <laughs> yeah. Is he alive still? Five ish. Five ish. Five ish yeah. Finkelstein. Five ish Finkel. I think it's <laughs> five ish Finkel. Yeah, we get five ish. Uh, he could play Adam. What was he? Was he in the monst- the monsters? If someone were to play me, it would probably be the guy Chris Moltisanti. That guy. <laughs> Michael Imperioli. Michael Imperioli. No. Nick was saying actually when we, we were watching the, goth we were son. watching Sopranos the other day he was saying something incredibly woke which is like look at how big Michael Imperioli's nose is why do we have to say that about Jews when there are all types of people with big noses no when I said, I said when I said, I said you, when I said why Italians you, sir, have <laughs> the <laughs> biggest schnozzes <laughs> yeah. there the are he was just being old school racist he was counting Italians as a different race I, what I said literally was Italians are worse than Jews <laughs> When it comes to that, there's well, nothing woke about that statement at well, all. Thank you for, for for saying I'm not the worst, and I appreciate that. Also, I don't know, pound for pound, nose for nose, I think Jews still still. My nose is it's that fuck, big. It's Italians. There's a lot of little nosed Italians, though. I don't see a lot of little nosed sure. Jews. Yes, there are. There are plenty. I don't think so. Yes, there are. Name one. I know like a bunch. Name one. Yeah, but you Sarah always go by Goldberg. <laughs> Sarah Goldberg. Yeah. Uh Rachel uh <laughs> Berg- Bergman. Bergman. I'm pretty sure that woman Bergman. who got her face chewed off by that chimpanzee was Jewish. That's why the nose attracted she the She doesn't chin. even have a nose anymore. <laughs> oh, that's true. All right, yeah. you get her. I'll give you her. Yeah. <laughs> that counts. That's a, that Okay. <laughs> Man, um, what a dumb story. What a hilarious dumb story. I mean, what the fuck kind of dumb bitch are you? You're going <laughs> to fucking right. bring a chimp into your home? <laughs> a no, dumb wild Wasn't animal? it her friend's chimp? She was friends with the woman who owned the chimp. I thought it was the woman who owned the chimp. No, it was... Either way, you're hanging yeah. out with a fucking chimp like it's, yeah. a, like it's your friend well, chimps, and not a wild I, animal. I think in popular culture, chimps are presented as nice. But in real life, they're really mean yeah, and strong. Yeah, they're mean as shit. They're super strong. Like, now who's unwoke? Yeah. I'm just saying I don't trust them. Yeah. Very funny. <laughs> I'm not saying that as a joke. Oh, yeah, wait. We all know who you're talking about. Dude. <laughs> <laughs> you get it. Yeah. I was talking about the animal, but your tone, Adam, is kind of weird, dude. What do you mean, my tone? We know what you mean. All right. I was talking about literal chimps, and you yeah. you, were, you were winking every time you yeah, said chimp. Yeah, you kept chimp. winking. I don't understand what, to where this is going. And pointing to a do-rag on the floor. Yeah. Why is that there's do-rag, no do-rag I keep on the floor? <laughs> Yeah, the pointing do rag, <laughs> <laughs> my secret signal, what I call the silent alarm of racism. The silent alarm. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck, we should just have a bunch. Does that is that racist if you just <laughs> carry around little artifacts <laughs> like you get a little gong, a little dreidel, just <laughs> point to them when you want to say something racist about? I don't know. Is that racist? <laughs> I don't know, guys. I don't that, know. That should be. They should rebrand Lucky Charms as like a racist cereal. Ooh, and that would all be the funny. marshmallows should be like different. I love it. Like you know, like mm-hmm. a fucking a little blackface guy, mm-hmm. and a swastika. Yeah, a swastika. That'd be cool for kids. <laughs> yeah. Well, to learn about heritage. Yeah, it's yo, it's Not fucking, hate. it's history, baby. <clears throat> I they love- should also draw a dick on Tony the Tiger. That's another change I would make if I was General Mills. <laughs> to draw a dick like as like a graffiti to deface him or no, give him a he penis. should have a realistic penis, a flaccid penis, obviously. Mm-hmm. And the tip of it is blue. I'm, like sure, it's blue. On, it's I'm blue. sure it's on DeviantArt. It definitely is. Of course is. it is. I'm sure. That's the only reason I'm thinking about it. Uh, we've all yeah. seen it. You've seen it. Yeah, I don't sent believe it, so. I've sent it to the chat sure. numerous times. We've Our talked chat? about this. The three of us have talked about it. Yeah. When? Oh, it looks There's like someone no doesn't joke read about the text it that you messages. can steal. I so read you, the text <laughs> messages. And you know what I like the most about the text messages? The respect. <laughs> 
<laughs> now the respect from the podcast carries over to the text. Look, Adam, yeah, there's like, your boyfriend Val Kilmer on the TV. <laughs> I'm a yeah, an enormous the once fan. in a gen- the greatest actor of our generation. I really Val think, Kilmer. <laughs> I really. I'm sorry, you can't convince me otherwise. I think he's one of the greatest he's actors just in the world. Fine. No, I, I disagree. And he was hot back in the day. I but think he's, he's looking amazing. Bad. He was a beautiful days. man. Yeah, he's sexy. Look back how there. incredible yeah. looking God he is. Damn. That is a movie star right there. Yeah. That guy kind of looks like him Soder. And, him and Sebastian Bach, the two <laughs> most beautiful men. <laughs> what was the name of that band? Skid Row? Skid, Skid Row. Row. Yeah. Uh, what was the... Why? What, who, what's bang, the big bang, name? bang, shoot him up! Yeah. How's he going to fucking have that name, dude? <laughs> Skid Row, dude. Sebastian <laughs> Bach? <laughs> He's Canadian, isn't he? Uh, I have Is no he? idea. Uh, they had, that, they had a couple good hits. What was the fucking... There's the one where it's like... Amadeus Mozart. No. The one with like w- the the kid fucks up. I don't know. The narrative about is a hair, 18, hair rock. Eighteen, 18 in, life. in life. That's the like big life. one. That's a good. And then one, they dude. had like uh, <clears throat> like slower uh, one of those like power ballads. Yeah, yeah, or whatever yeah, the fuck. yeah, yeah. I didn't yeah. listen to much of that. I was listening to more of Joan Baez. The music sucks. I don't know why they fucking the like hair no, metal bands would do that shit. I love that shit, dude. Like fucking, that music uh, was the worst. It was like no. Queen, Queensryche. I never fuck with Queen Strike. I like some that Motley Crue though. Well, it was all because Jesus of Christ. Priest and early Motley Crue rules. Yeah. No, Judas Priest is good. No, Maiden and Priest know. were good, and then everyone tried to rip it off. Iron Maiden's whatever. Maiden rules. Hair metal is a different Hell category. Yes. <laughs> you're confusing. You're confusing the new wave of British heavy metal with hair metal. Yes, well, hair I think that's that what the not two sunset strip labels. Shit. No, labels that that LA shit. shit. Yeah, 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 yeah. You know what? What movie Shh, captures fuck. that scene really? Rat. That scene really well is uh, fucking pie. Airheads. Did you ever see that movie? I, I, I loved Airheads when I was a kid. I, I, watched I would, watch, I would watch. I know, not on Comedy Central. I had a tape inc- from Blockbuster really? on VHS, and I would fucking watch that movie every. It's single incredible. Time. Buscemi's in it, dude. Yeah. It's it's really. I don't funny. remember if it holds up, but I loved it as a child. And it's really weird it's that Adam like, Sandler. It was Steve before Buscemi Sandler was like a and star, Brandon and Frazier. Brendan Fraser. Yeah. Yeah. It was before Sandler was like and Kramer. Yes, yes that's Kramer right. is stuck in a vent yeah, the, the whole vent. movie. Yeah. The whole good, good movie. Kramer shit. Just doing fucking yeah. physical comedy, no N words. Was he ever. Did he. Anything other than Seinfeld, did he fucking have a. Yeah, a he had role? his own show, the Michael Richards show. I remember Richard that. Show. That sucked. But I mean, like, was there. Because that was a good role for him. Because he's mm. just doing Kramer yeah, shit. Yeah, he was in a couple of other movies. Yeah, just. Oh, yeah, he was in that movie, that Weird Al movie, right? UHF. 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 Was that's that? good. I know I don't fuck with Weird Al's UFC? songs. UFC? But that movie is oh, good. Oh, no. Fuck off, dude. Weird Al's tight. Uh, whatever, dude. I used to love that shit, dude. <laughs> yeah. What, it doesn't matter. The point You're is... You're just mad because of that fat song. I am mad. Yeah, you probably loved Weird Al, and then that song came out, and you were like <laughs> 12, and you were like... <laughs> what? Come on, man! <laughs> Mr. <laughs> Yankovic. <laughs> that's angrily that's angry. Write a that's letter. That's the first letter I wrote. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> shoving them all down your mouth. Didn't Coolio get mad at him about Amish Paradise? Yeah. Probably. He's like, this is a serious song about, about like, yeah. a gangster issues. paradise. About yeah. gangsters. Filled with a bunch of warning do-rags on the floor. <laughs> <laughs> Where did that come from? I don't know. It's a that's weird thing. Funny. I just said it. That's so funny. I was funny. being racist. That's such a weird thing to think of. It is a weird thing to think of. Yeah. You should probably remember it and then forget where you uh, heard <laughs> yeah. it. You should bring and it up in two podcasts. Yes. Yes. Yeah. Stop it. Stop it right now. Stop tarnishing my name. I can't wait till you say you the have char- this cocoa butter on the floor that you oh. point to. The character yeah, assassination live, live at the Adam greatest Friedland. comedy show of all time. <laughs> On June twentieth, <laughs> I'm gonna wear That's a some fucking shitty Williamsburg bar. Where is it? What's it called? I don't know, dude. Can you stop it? No. <laughs> Can you stop it? No, dude. I'm fucking negativity central. <laughs> Whatever. Who gives a shit? I don't care. Anymore. I don't give a shit either. <laughs> um, what the fuck were we just talking about? I mean, you're supposed oh. to get old and be bitter, right? Yeah, yeah but you're like. 23 years old. We're not that old. Oh, by the way, the, to yeah, the whole squad. I'm HIV positive. <laughs> Yo, got, follow me on Instagram. My, my shit's back. Off. Oh, yeah. Stop the baby's sexy back. bug. Stavi baby, too. Follow your boy. I'm back, oh, that I'm back in the mix. Back. Oh. It ain't a gimmick. It's art. Yeah, you know what, man? The best thing that ever I'm happened to you was model. having that account shut down. No. I will, listen, we can shit on Adam's dumb things that are going on in his life, but this is... I'm telling you, man. This is my shit. At least I'm not trying to... You're pigeonholing yourself. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to be a model, dude. You're not going to stop me. I'm going to be a plus-size model. I'm going to be on fucking magazines. That was like fat juice What if you lose weight? No. I can lose weight. I'll still rock that shit. No, you can't do it anymore if you're like healthy. Wow, all bodies are beautiful, Adam. 
Apparently you know, not mine. You guys were shitting on my legs yours. earlier. All bodies except yours. And your I have little, a very nice toned and body. And your little ass fucking toothpick legs. I have nice legs and I just choose to sit gaily with them. No. No, you don't. Yes, I do. And it's a choice. <clears throat> it's anyway. a neurological choice. <laughs> <laughs> like, uh, like being gay. What? Anyway, you are sitting in a hilarious position right now. Adam is presenting his asshole to me. <laughs> I remember like being a kid and knowing that it was like wrong to sit that way. Yeah. On your yeah. side with your legs folded up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I would never be caught dead doing that. <clears throat> what about yeah. this? That's fine. Now you look alpha. That, I feel that's good like, like that's like a like a a Moroccan businessman kind of lounge. <laughs> <laughs> My friend, please come here to look at me, please. I used to think when I was a we kid... Have, we, have, we have big pipe to smoke together. <laughs> what do they do in Morocco? I know they don't drink. Um, they smoke hookah. They got spicy foods. They pack yeah. mad hooks, dude. They taste spices. <laughs> yeah. My friend, please sit here to taste spice. <laughs> here, Korean. Please, you come here to taste spice with me. Uh, Morocco's mm, fly cool, home on the carpet. They wear little fezes, dude. Yeah, yeah. they wear well, fezes. Well, they do in Fez. Mm. The home of the Fez. That's where Zidane is from. Zidane's Moroccan. Zinedine. Yeah, but he plays for France. <clears throat> I love how the French f- soccer team is just really good African dudes yeah, from they, French-speaking African yeah, yeah, countries. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. and then people are like, <clears throat> oh, colonialism is bad. Yeah. <laughs> one negative effect. Yeah. And Zinedine I, well, I Zidane. Zidane. Patrick Vieira. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Zidane's the fucking. Now he's managing. He's fucking. Yeah, he not won just the Champions butting. League. Yeah, dude. I want to start like a and fake that's woke petition to get yeah. Colonial Williamsburg shot down. <laughs> <laughs> I bet you could do it. I bet you could fucking get them to shut down Colonial Williamsburg. Let's try it. You started enough of a stink. Or how about this? Because it's just as bad as, like, you know, heritage, not hate, right? Yeah. Colonialism is bad. Let's turn yeah. no, Brooklyn agree. Williamsburg into Colonial I Williamsburg. I already made that oh, joke. Oh, my on God. The show. When did you? When? <laughs> when? At the beginning of the show, I did a joke. Today? About, no. When? On the podcast, at one point, I made a joke. Run the tape. About <laughs> how both of them are sort of Colonial Williamsburg. It's a if pretty you obvious connection yeah. to make. <clears throat> oh, now you're shitting on the yeah. joke you tried to steal? Yeah. <laughs> How would I steal a joke? You fucking parasite. <laughs> You've stolen from me. <laughs> both of you. I've never stolen anything from you. Yes, you both have. Oh, yeah, we both, we yes, both have. tweeted gay political shit to try and get retweeted on purpose. <laughs> by the flower, that's by the flower that's kids. That's what we've stolen. <laughs> so I've stole that joke to me about... Being so fat that I have to pee a lot. That's yeah. my joke. That's your joke. Yeah, and Nick stole the joke from me about um, Harambe. About, yeah, it takes out for her. <laughs> Harambe. That meme Great that meme. I started. Yeah, we started that meme. Well, we're bringing it back, actually. We literally <laughs> should. That would be hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what's up? Dicks out for Harambe. Is it, is, it, is it long enough for it to be ironically funny? No, it's not long enough, which makes it funnier, right? No, it's it's that, too soon. Harambe will never cycle back in because it was like instantly... Um, it, like passed through the not funny anymore right, phase right, right. to it's already going to be ironically funny in perpetuity. Right, right, and right. And so like... It was. It'll. It never was funny, and it never will right, be. Right, 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 right. It was funny, but no, it will it be funny. Yeah, you no. loved it the day it started because it's not it. funny. Because it's not funny. It went like immediately to. But what I'm saying is, it'll be funny in terms of making Brandon mad. Oh yeah, to make fun of Brandon. And funny. you're confusing me writing a good stand-up bit about a thing that happened. Yeah, right, you have a right, thing right. in your act about it. No, but it's. A I different... wrote a joke. I mean, I can write a joke about something. It's not that a happens. meme. It's not. Me thinking it's just funny that a gorilla is of named course. Harambe. No, but you thought that the social, uh, the you know the the reaction to it was funny. That's what everyone was responding. No, to. No, I wrote a no, joke about, about it zoo. because I'm a comedian and that's my job. Well, okay. So I, I wonder a how difference. much you made from from that joke. One hundred and fifty thousand dollars. <laughs> okay, I stand corrected. Yeah. Do you even have Do you even have a fucking account at the comedian store? That's where me and Nick go. We get paid out for our bits yeah, when dude. we write them. Yeah, let's yeah. Let's, even, do, let's, let's let's just uh, let's start listing off clubs that we've worked that we <laughs> yeah. like. We'll all do it. All three of us. We're gonna list. Uh, you want to start in off. New York? Yeah, mm-hmm. sure. All right. Uh, Caroline's good club. Uh, New York Comedy Club. Yeah, that one's yeah. good. Adam, uh, yeah, you've never performed there, Adam. Adam, your turn. 
I enjoyed performing at the Comedy Cellar, actually. <laughs> in the Greenwich Oh, really? Village. I, I, I was at the Village, Village Underground. Which one were you at? I was at the main room, the <laughs> Comedy Cellar. The cellar part, actually. Um, if anyone who listens to the show knows uh, uh, the people at the Comedy Cellar, uh, feel free to tell them that Adam Friedland is going around telling people <laughs> he's a past <laughs> cellar comedian. That's fun. And he's doing it maliciously. <laughs> To sully the name. Can I tell you about my night last night? Yeah. No. Okay. Yeah, go ahead. I went. I went out. Got walking. a slice of pizza. <laughs> oh, good. Oh, yeah. We all know you where this stopped. one's going. <laughs> I bought a slice of pizza. You came out of the subway, uh-huh. but I only ate half the pizza. Were your daughters so annoying you? They were cunts. Yeah. My daughters were being cunts. What about your ex-wife? I found this. My like, ex-wife's black. <laughs> I found this like YouTube video. It was either YouTube or like Vine or Twitter or something. Oh, the German? Yeah, there's this like German guy that was like, "Yo, here it is. Uh, where Louis gets uh, the pizza on uh, Louis?" Just <laughs> <laughs> like videotaping the West Village and screaming. That's awesome. That place where has is good that? pizza. Minetta. What's the uh, place called? I don't know, corner? but it's right on the corner. Yeah. yeah, it's right on the corner. It's like Ben's or some Ben's. shit. Yeah, yeah, that's it. They got a good it grandma is, slice. Yeah. It is good. They have a fucking a sign that says it says like artichoke special. <laughs> yes. It's spelled special S P I C I A L. Yes. But there is an artichoke by there. Artichoke yeah, pizza. Yeah. Fuck artichoke pizza. Artichoke choke pizza sucks, dude. It's That's okay. not New York it's style creamy. pizza. It isn't. No. And the bread is all fucking it's thick. It's thick. Yeah, that's bullshit. I like a thin crust. Nice thin crust. Nice little thin crust. Nice I like a, I like a, a, a Chicago style fork and knife kind of pizza. <laughs> what if we open one of those a real here pie. in New York? A oh, real yeah. pie. You know the I will say Pizza Hut has some doughy ass delicious crust. I agree. I, I haven't used had to, a pizza you ever go to a pizza a pizzeria Uno. Yeah, I, I remember that one. place. They have one uh on like 73rd or something. There's some one in a story actually Uptown? very close to me. Yeah. I've only been to a couple of them, but I, I like I like them. Do you remember? <laughs> you know, I'm a fan. I'm a fan of pizza. Do you remember Round Table? Huh? Round Table Pizza. No. It was like a King Arthur style pizza. Isn't that what Herman Cain owned? No, no Godfather. 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 That's right. Round Table. What What does King Arthur style mean? Uh, it was just it had a kind of a night aesthetic. It was a pizza place, but yeah, yeah. Um. um yeah, Little dude. Caesars. Fuck yeah. his name. Yeah, yeah, just name pizza restaurants. Yeah, totally out of time. But five dollars hot and ready, pretty good deal. When I was working at the damn uh, paint store, I would I would scarf down a couple. We of should, those You a know week. what? Instead of getting what? steaks, we should go to Pizza Hut, boys. No, dude, I'm a, I'm a paleo warrior. I want to go forget. to a Pizza Hut I restaurant. I haven't had a good. You know what? I order so much good New York pizza that I haven't had a shitty pizza in a long time. Mm-hmm. I went to the Papa John's in Chinatown one time and got a large pizza there. Yeah. The menu's all in Chinese. <laughs> Hell yeah, it's just sea urchin pizza. Yeah, it was great. Um, I was at, I was at your comedy club again, a comedy club that I perform at. Where is that? Um, where is it? I just I don't know. I'm I'm more into the avant garde. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Avant garde performance spaces. Getting I call them booked. Spaces. Getting booked is hack, right? Yeah, is that yeah, how you feel? I, well, I think I love know. to be on comedy shows where the people that I consider contemporaries have never actually done stand up. <laughs> I like to be the and only, they're not even considered funny. I people. like to be the only non-feminist uh, tweet uh, reader on a show. <laughs> I like that. That's that's my vibe, guys. That's my wheelhouse. Um, uh, but yeah, Alexis Guerrero's. You know how he fucking always talks about how he loves pizza and shit. Yeah, he claimed he had Dude, he never. He talks about how he loves every type of food. I know, but he claimed he had never seen a Papa John's pizza in his life. Never seen. Never seen one. <laughs> and seen the we were just pizza like, or the restaurant. shut the fuck up. That <laughs> you've seen it. Like that doesn't mean you've eaten it. Anyway, yeah. Robbie Slowick just bought. Two I overheard. I overheard. Papa John's one of my favorite things about Alexis is like. I, I've never once interacted with that guy where food doesn't come up. Of ever. course, no. Ever. No. Ever. I, absolutely. You know, I'm not he was like a pizza guy. I love it, though. I mean, I, I'm a gourmand myself. Yeah, yeah. No, it's take, fine. Like, I like on pizza yeah, yeah, yeah. tours. But he fucking... Uh, there was one time I was standing outside of a club and I heard him talking to somebody else and he was saying something like, uh, like, oh yeah, and there's this other place, it's a secret bakery and it's not open to the public yet. <laughs> <laughs> a secret bakery. Yeah. That is that's the highest level of fat guy shit. <laughs> Knowing secrets, just fucking obese people <laughs> yeah, yeah. licking fucking frosting <laughs> off each other's fingers. 
Um, oh, fuck. Yeah. But yeah, so Robbie ordered a Papa John's pizza, and I had so I had a slice for old time's sake. That was my family's pizza of choice growing up, was Papa John's, then later Filippo's. I didn't discover Papa John's chain. until I was an adult. Really? My stepsisters loved Domino's. Mm, so they would no. order from Domino's. Domino's sucked when we were Domino's kids, Domino's is the absolute it's worst. It's the worst. It still sucks. It's, it's a little better it's now. It's not good, but they would only order Domino's, and then I became an adult, and I started ordering Papa John's. The app is cool. And uh, it's the best pizza yeah. in the world. It's the, uh, yeah. Papa the John's? Pizza. Yeah, yeah. I shitty mean, pizza. Shitty. Pizza Hut is the best. Shitty That's pizza. a different. I think yeah, I put that in a different really get, division. I, 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 pizza Hut isn't like a. Growing a up, delivery. Pizza Hut was delivery. No, maybe in Vegas. In not, Vegas, not was. in Maryland. I, I think I think some places delivered, but the, it was yeah. a rarity to actually see pizza. When my Hut. family ordered pizza, absolutely, we would get Pizza Hut. Well, 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 we mm-hmm. get it. Mm-hmm. It's you, also you Pizza Hut doesn't. I, I'm yeah, pretty sure Pizza Hut doesn't work like. We're fucking loaded, dude. Gaddy's Pizza, Papa John's, Domino's, fucking never heard of Gaddy's. Uh, they all operate on the same. Like it's you go in the kitchen, it looks identical. Right, they have right, the same right. make line. Industrial, yeah. And it's like a process to like once you order the pizza, it'll be like in the oven in like four and a half minutes. Mm-hmm. Yes, they have like uh, people from corporate that come by. Right, right. I was right. actually working at Domino's when I started doing stand up, and I like one of the first bits I did was about like the corporate inspection process. Mm-hmm. Of Dom- like they send a fucking woman from Domino's corporate that like literally counts the pepperonis <laughs> on the pizza how many pepperonis making. on a large I don't know. It's, uh, on an extra large I think it's like 25 pepperonis or some shit very nice um, that's quality control it's bullshit is what it is <laughs> who's fucking count my I favorite s- my favorite moment in all of my time working in pizza was this Indian family that used to call into the Domino's and they would order a vegetarian <laughs> pizza and they'd be like, and it is very important that the cutter does not use on uh, a meat pizza also. And so it has to be a different cutter to cut the pizza. Yeah, yeah. And I'd be like, oh, yeah, absolutely. Of course, yeah. And then uh, just immediately just cut right through yeah, that yeah, shit. Yeah. Rub the, pepperoni the on that Yeah, of course. Yeah. Fuck you. Because it's not an allergy thing. It's just stupid fucking religion. Right, right, right. I think it's a smart religion. Personally. I think all religions are... Beautiful. <laughs> Don't touch my PlayStation controllers. Why? Get your fucking hands off of them. I'm not touching anything. Which religion? Adam's going to come about? back as a toilet in India. That's what he's going to be reincarnated as. <laughs> yeah, well. A big shit eating toilet. I want to be reincarnated as me, but with a bigger dick. That's one of my ideas. <laughs> Hell yeah, dude. That's a badass. That's a cool cast system. Exactly the same as me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. But big ass dick, dude. <laughs> you, you'll know you're reaching nirvana when your yeah, dick yeah, is yeah. just like 14 inches long. Yeah. And just well, like... Bodhi Dharma's legs fell off because he like sat and meditated for so Holy long. But shit. I think it's because his dick was so big. So big, dude. The, the guy's dick hard to cut off the circulation. Whose legs fell off? Bodhi Dharma. Who's that? The first Zen monk. <coughs> oh. Dharma from Dharma and Greg's yeah, dad. Yeah, that actually, I, I've done that joke. No, you haven't. I did episode uh, eleven. Yeah, actually, episode yeah. eleven. Yeah, if you want to run the tape. <laughs> yeah, I'd love to run the tape. <laughs> All right, but if you don't, if we run it back and you didn't do it, we get to break your glasses. <laughs> Why do you get to break my glasses? Just Can somebody these... check if if hey, if any of the good <laughs> no combos one's checking. out there? No one is check checking. and see if. In fact, no I almost feel like the show. <coughs> you might have stolen a Dharma and Greg joke from one of us. It feels like you did. When? I don't know, but it feels that way. Did you actually even watch Dharma and Greg? Because I did. I did, too. Yeah, I remember it. Who was in it? Dharma and Greg. <laughs> it was that guy, Eric something, that played Greg. What's the name? What was no. the woman's name? Nope. His name's Greg. Not in real life. What was the woman's the name? The character's name is Greg. Jenna Elfman. All right, all right. Eric. Jenna Elfman. It's a guy named Greg on the show. <laughs> And a woman named Dharma. Oh, wow, because I just made that joke. <laughs> That's what joke? I'm describing the that. show to you. He asked me who, what the people's name was, and I said Dharma and Greg. And then you, 20 seconds later... No, you said it was a guy steal. named Eric. You said Stav back me up here. No, that's a cop. Oh, 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 yeah, it's Stav back me up. You 100% said Eric. He's He's gonna not said Eric. Oh, because you're the captain? You said you're the boss? He has to back you up, First of all, obviously he's going to back you up. Nick is a uh, fuck. What was Nick? Sav is a fucking union scab. He's not gonna. Yeah, he would not no. stand by my side. You're not in the union. Well, no, we're <laughs> I'm in. Me you can't Sava be in the union and be the boss. Yes, you we're can. Union. What the fuck are you talking about? No, we're a union. You're the boss. <laughs> you're fu- wait. What was your name? Pussy. You're mouth. Our boss. Pussy mouth. That was your nickname. 
Pussy mouth? <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm big pussy I'm mouth. Can- I'm candy lips. <laughs> I'm big pussy mouth bumping Sarah. You know what's a great movie? What? Joyride. Yeah. Oh, with... Uh, Steve Zahn, yes. Paul Walker, and mm-hmm. uh, I forget who the girl is. Let's get Paul back under the under the hood. Let's dude. get him on the podcast. He's got a nude heaven. Paul Walker in that. Ooh, movie. front front nude fully nude you see his cock you see his dick going into his own mouth <laughs> his dick is the most socal dick i've ever seen yeah is it nice he's and got tan? a visor on him yeah, yeah. He's got, he had a him cut his, necklace when he got circumcised <laughs> he had him, <laughs> <laughs> cut his foreskin into a, an upside down visor <laughs> one of the ball one of his ball hairs has like beaded yeah. hair <laughs> <laughs> yeah cool pack son <laughs> i remember being intimidated by that story when I was a me kid. too. No joke. I swear to God, yeah. I thought it was too cool for me. Yeah, <laughs> I'm that's not even ex- kidding. That's exactly how I felt. I'm like, that's where cool kids yeah. go. <laughs> that's so fucking funny. <laughs> oh, <I'm> fucking loser. <laughs> I swear to God, that's how I felt. I did not feel ready for fucking back sun, dude. Yeah. No. I would just go to Value City and hope there was Billabong there, <laughs> like discount Billabong at yeah. Value City. Yeah, I'll get it from from yeah. CJ Maxx. I remember I had a quick silver. Wallet and that was like as close as I could get. Yes, dude. Hell it was yes. Like flying too close to the sun. <laughs> oh my god. Dude, know, it's dude. funny. Maybe you guys I I wouldn't mention him for a- anymore, but I uh, I saw Cockfield's wallet one time and he uh-huh. still uses one of those like Velcro oh, team that's wallets. That's hilarious. Yeah. They just <laughs> yeah, rip yeah. open. The, the like threefold. It doesn't have a man's wallet like that. Like, oh, that's a, Look at that. that's a big boy's wallet. That's a fucking. What do you think of it? No, money. nice and smooth. I want to get a seat, good wallet. Carry cash on me. You don't carry cash. No, All cryptocurrency, cash. dude. How you call yourself a man then? What do these men carry cash? No, that's what being a man is all about. How much? Give me your wallet. No. Let's see your wallet. No. Oh, he Let's brought his, his purse pockets. with him. <laughs> <laughs> no, you can't. You see go my back wallet. pocket. So, yeah. Here, the, there's a diva cup in here. <laughs> some tampons. <laughs> Roxanne Gay's book. <laughs> I don't think it's nice to call her that name. What? Is that not her name? Roxanne, put kidding. on the red velvet. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, fuck. <clears throat> yeah, dude. Stop. Do you believe in her? Her? Are you like? Do you identify with her fat stuff, dude? I'm first and foremost. I'm fat. Yeah. Then I'm everything else. After American, that. Greek, Greek number man. one. No, no. I'm fat Christian, Greek American, <laughs> <laughs> lover. Son, that's it, dude. That's the hierarchy. What about a comic? Uh, comic, comic last. No, yeah. I, I appreciate that. You know, you some know, things are more important. Me. What's yours? Uh, consumer, racist, <laughs> shorts, Homer Simpson, <laughs> mm-hmm. uh, laser tag, yeah. enthusiast, laser tag enthusiast. You know mine? <laughs> yeah. Number one, Israel. Number two. <laughs> Number two, friends of Chapo. Crip, a crypto yeah, yeah. Ends with the Chapo. I know Will yeah. Menneker. <laughs> good, good friends. Good friends with Chapo. Number three, by extension, uh, sort of friends with the. Yeah. Number three, uh, went to a DSA meeting one time and paid the membership fee. <laughs> number four, uh, uh, crypto cur- gay. Number, f- number, number five, number five, girl version of Eve Pizer. <laughs> <laughs> That's not nice. I know. That's not nice to me. It's a double whammy. I got everybody with that. That's super one, dude. And and nobody can get mad at me because then then that tells me something about how you feel about gender. Absolutely. That's what you call a gotcha. (laughs) Operation, what was it from the last one? (laughs) Two birds birds with a stone. stone. Yeah. You guys don't... Can I just say my number five? <laughs> yeah, sure. Latin X. Oh man, stop! We got to get this feel a tracksuit, dude. I've yeah, been looking really online good. for feel a tracksuits. I can't find any good ones. No, look at I this want one, velour feel it. Yeah, that looks. I good. want the one Paulie has. Yeah, Adam, don't pretend like you're involved in this. What are you, are, what are you talking about? <laughs> you don't own any tracksuit. It was my idea. Suit. No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. <laughs> oh, it was my idea. Me and Stav literally own numerous tracks. I own. We I have own a lot a of Adidas gear. We've, we've Before had the them podcast, for years. we did a bit. Yeah, dude. Didn't we do a? Didn't we do we've a fake tracksuit? I was stealing money from the truck. To buy tracks. Didn't we do a fake GoFundMe? Wasn't that one of the big things? Yes, we did. We did. Yeah. And it wasn't fake, it was real. <laughs> yeah, do we, we have any money intention in that? of buying the. <laughs> no, right, but guys, we'll just enjoy Guys, find, your find me and Nick's GoFundMe. Yeah, just and enjoy donate your, to it. Your friend thing that you guys would. 
with your tracks. Look, we're not friends. We're both in the union, and we <laughs> yeah. have to support. You're each other. not in the union if you're the boss, <laughs> and you give us zero benefits. <laughs> oh shit! You trying to strike for fucking dental, dude? I'm not trying to strike. I appreciate everything. <laughs> <laughs> that Nick does for us. <laughs> what a bitch, dude. No, you're the union no, scout. No, no. No, I'm that's gonna get, true. I'm going to replace you with cheap Chinese labor. <laughs> yeah. That would be great. I'm going to no get joke. an Asian guy named no Cheap joke. Chinese Labor. <laughs> What do you think about that? That'd that Chinese so yeah, it's very good, very good. Yeah, yeah. Can yeah. we try that one? Can you fill some time, cheap Chinese saver? <laughs> okay. Uh, this week, uh, Grand Greenwald, <laughs> he tweeted, uh, and then he just does whatever you do. I never talk about Glenn Greenwald on this. <laughs> I don't know. Some I respect movie, him too so. much. <laughs> is he? Is he? Is he the guy who beat? Who started to suck off a kid? Or is that <laughs> what? Yeah. No, that's Alan Dershowitz, dude. I don't know who Grand um, Greenwald is. Well, that's what he's doing in Brazil. No, nice. he's just legally married to his husband. Nah, dude, he went oh. to Brazil. He went to Brazil because <laughs> he's a hero. Dude. You go, you go to the kids hit puberty at three down <laughs> yeah. there. You so, know what my friend told me today. What? It was so fucking funny that in British society, like, like a, a while a while back, boys. Weren't allowed to wear pants until fifteen. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that was so they did funny. That, they did that in like America too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like boys like, always wear. My favorite is like boys, old timey pictures where like wear shorts. they they put like little boys in like dresses and yeah. sailor outfits. Oh, it's so good. Oh, I got yeah. one of me so in a sailor good. outfit. Yeah, <laughs> I'm gonna share that. I'm gonna find that next time I go to Baltimore. I look cute as hell, dude. Uh, all right. Well, so what are we doing? Are we wrapping this up here? Uh, how much time? I do have a spot. We're one oh five. Oh, nice. All right. So well. Um, don't we have a show coming up, Adam? Monday. The 26th, uh, we have a show at Come On Everybody, uh, uh, Funny Moms, the whole squad will be there. Uh, we don't know the lineup yet, but it's gonna be good as hell. And, uh, follow me on Instagram, StavvyBaby2, S-T-A-V-V-Y Baby2. You know, time to fucking bring body positivity back. Um, so, thank you for <laughs> listening to Come Town. Everyone. Yeah, we don't have to stall for more time. We're done. All right. Goodbye, everyone.